best ladies on this Thursday the 16th. Hope you're having a great day so far. Hope the uh, week is going well for you. Let's jump right into today's announcements. Here we go. Uh, first of all, Hannah, now listen carefully, Hannah. I don't want to confuse you, okay? Today's Thursday. Yesterday on Wednesday, we worked on this assignment here. You turned it in. That's great. You're good. On Tuesday, we worked on the review sheet. Page 291. That's the one that's worth five bonus points, okay? Now, Hannah, if you finish this assignment here, turn it in, you'll get five bonus points. Okay, but it has to be turned in today in order for you to get the five bonus points. Now, if you did not finish it, you still have to turn it in, okay? In order to get um, credit for the test. You have to turn it into assignments. Now, you've turned this one in already, so you're fine, but you've not turned this one in, okay? Seely, you may turn in both of these assignments if you want, or keep them and turn them in Monday when you take the test. It's up to you, okay? Totally your decision. Incomplete. Uh, Seely, you still owe me this here. Now, it has to be turned in today, or it's going to be a permanent zero, okay? was due Tuesday. So please um, take care of that, okay? Okay, today, Hannah, you're going to take the test. Seely, you're going to work on math. So, Seely, for you, please watch this. Started at 510, ended at 2910. Not bad, okay? When you're finished, please work on this homework. Here's the help video. Oh, about 15 minutes. Now, Hannah, you do not have to do any of this or any of this. You're going to do that on Monday when you come back from break. And on Monday, Seeley's going to take the test, okay? Now, Seeley, Hannah, both of you, both of you have some papers in the folder. Would you please get those out? That would be a big help to me. Sorry for yawning. Okay, Hannah, let's go over your test. So, Hannah, please pause the video. Oh, Seeley, you're good. That's all. Have a good day. You can go and start working on your work. Now, Hannah, please pause the video. Get a copy of the test. I sent it to Mrs. Twitchell and also to Mrs. Little. So, please get a copy of the test and then restart the video. Okay, page one, fill in the blank. Page two, fill in the blank. Number nine, um, prove that theorem right there. Ten. List out the sets of congruent angles and the sets of congruent sides. Now, Hannah, listen carefully. For numbers eleven and twelve, decide if the triangles are congruent or not. If they're not, just say no, and you're finished. Got it? But if they are, give me the reason. So you'll say side, 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 or side, angle, side, or angle, side, angle, or angle, angle, side, or hypotenuse leg. But Hannah, there's something else. Sorry for yawning. After you have written in your reason for the triangles to be congruent in the second blank, give me a congruent statement like triangle M O P is congruent to triangle X Y, Z. Now, Hannah, when you do that, be careful. Make sure you line up corresponding angles with um, corresponding angles. Okay? Now, um, that's for 11 and 12. Number 13 and 14, Hannah, find the length of the um, segment. Sorry for yawning again. I'm very tired. Please find the length of the uh, segments. And then 15, do that proof. Okay? And then look on the back page. There's a word bank for you that might help you fill in the blanks a little easier. Okay? Um, that's it, ladies. Um, see any for you. Please get to work on your homework and your notes. And for you, please get to work on your test. Have a great day. Contact me if you have any questions at all.